is if you look at your family and generations back, all right, they didn't come from wealth, 98% of us. Maybe there's one or 2% of us here that did or had a privileged life. I'm not talking to you. I am talking to you, but I'm not talking to you in that regard. I'm talking to 98% of us that was born to this earth where our parents had this energetic DNA that was screwed up because their parents were screwed up because their parents' 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 went back multiple generations, went back a couple of hundred years, if you think about it. To go back a couple of hundred years, you just have to go back five people, right? Simple. And we're talking 1800s, 1700s, all now come, and here you are, you're born. And if you don't change it, you're part of statistics of the 98% of the people that will die at the age of 65 or die by the age of 65, dead or dead broke. Period, end of story. How do we fix that? How do we change that energetic DNA that you were born with? Now, from the time you're born until now, a lot of us have pain and anguish. We've come from bad neighborhoods. We've come from violent situations. We come from negative. We come from poor families. And we've all had different pains in our life. And I'm sorry. I wish I can go and take away things that happen to you. I wish I can go and take that out of you right now. I wish I can go and just heal you. I can't. I can, but I can't. I can give you the tools and tell you what to do. When we heal that, when we heal this energetic inflammation that's limiting your vision, if you had so much pain in your tooth, you can't think. And if you got so much pain in your arm, you can't think, you take ibuprofen. Imagine if there was a pill that you take, it's a bottle cap. Imagine if there was a, a, bit, a pill you take that healed anything anybody has ever done to you in your past and gave you a clean slate. If there was a way for you to take a pill that healed everything you negative that's happened to you, imagine how much further you would go. So lowering, there's a process to this. There's a process to getting you where you want to go. And I'm going to go through this with you to get to that end result where you attract anything you want instantaneously. Right now, you have the power to attract anything, good or bad. And unfortunately, how many of you attract bad when you say, oh, man, I'm so stupid. I'm freaking so stupid. I shouldn't have done that. You know what? You're going to become more stupid. Oh, man, I can't afford that. You're right. You're going to continue to stay broke. Oh, man, that's too hard. I'll never. You're right. It's too hard. You say things to yourself and you don't realize it. Number one, you got to stop saying all that garbage. You got to rephrase it a little bit differently. I mean, I got all this credit card debt. You're right. You're going to have a lot more. The credit card debt's going to keep coming at you because you don't understand. Man, I can't find any good people to work with. I can't find any good people that want to be on my team. I can't find any good quality people. You are right. You will continue to not find any good quality people. Be careful what you say because you will get it. Be careful what you say because it will come to you. All the things that you've been saying are now coming to you continuously. You have to change a few things. People, and I want you to understand something. Just because we work today doesn't mean tomorrow you're going to change. Understand, and let's be real. If you take a seed and you plant it in the ground, it may take three months. It may take seven days. It may take four months to pop and grow. So imagine all the negative you've been planting up until this moment, today even, this hour even, this morning. What did you plant that wasn't so positive that may come, 
that may come to haunt you in a day, in a month, in two, in three months. So understand what you sow is what you reap. But if we start changing the corner today and we start planting different seeds today, tomorrow and the next day and the next day and the next month, you're going to see the old seeds pass and the new seeds that you planted will come and overshadow the negatives and see you grow a bit higher.